the forehead of your robot. It was a regular day on Roblox. I was playing a game that was able to scan the platform for really obscure games, I'm talking places with 0 to 100 visits. While browsing the list of experiences, I came across an interesting place. It was called, My Universe, by someone named, Rodin. At first, I thought nothing more than just a place filled with free models created by a kid, and definitely not what I was about to experience. The place had only one visit. I decided to check it out for some reason. After I got teleported into his universe, I was met with a white sky on a platform made of white grass, but the weirdest part was the sound. There was what sounded like an audio clip of an alarm, slowed down to the point of it sounding like souls screaming. It felt really bone chilling. I decided to walk forward on some tight white grass parts, I came across one part that was slightly broken. Ignoring it, I continued my way by jumping on a white grass cube, and reaching one part of this place that made me question. What was the creator of this place thinking to make this? There was a weird formation in the ground formed from four long parts, the main path, a horizontal part and two diagonal ones, shaped like an asterisk. On the end of every part, there was a weird object with a giant ray reaching the sky, similar to a beacon. Touching them had no effect, so I continued with more thoughts raising in my head. Eventually I reached the edge of the path. Was this over? Did the creator of this game wanted me to jump into the pit and commit suicide? What were the intentions of this Rodin guy? I pressed the W key, and as I was about to jump into the pit, I got teleported on top of a platform, made of the same white grass. Soon, I came to the conclusion that it was over, since there wasn't anything to do left. Until I came across a slightly transparent part. Touching it, led to me being teleported to a new place. This one was dark. It was a small place with four invisible walls around me, and my avatar was completely dark. Also the soul's screaming sounds were replaced with a really deep bass ambient sound. The only thing of interest was the really shiny glowing stone in the dead center of the map. Touching it led to the whole screen to turn blue, and the client crashed completely. I couldn't do anything, except to get task manager and to force close Roblox. How could someone even make a game that would crash the entire Roblox client? At this point, I had to know who was this Rodin guy, and what were his motives. So, I searched for his profile, and it turns out, he is quite recent. He has no friends, no other games or any kind of presence besides his default looking Roblox avatar. It's been two weeks since the Rodin incident, and I've been experiencing unusual things. My computer began running really slow, random notepad documents would appear, saying my full name, and files moved in different places. But the scariest thing, was when I turned on my PC, and saw my desktop change from the default Windows 10 background, to a black background with white scratchy letters, spelling the name of that dreadful user, Rodin.